All right, boys and girls, today for your math, I would like you to get out your Play-Doh and you are gonna create two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes. Remember our two-dimensional shapes are flat shapes and our three-dimensional shapes are solid figures. So you will create some flat shapes and some solid shapes. You can start with whatever you would like. So if you wanna start with the three-dimensional shapes, Get out some of your Play-Doh and mold them and build them to create our three-dimensional shapes. So I've already created one right there. What shape is that? It is a sphere. Okay, you can get out more Play-Doh and create another one or you can take this and make it into another three-dimensional shape. So I think I can roll it out a little bit this way. And it's starting to form a different shape. All right, here's my next shape. This one rolls. It has two faces. And if I stamp it, each face will be a circle. This is a cylinder. All right, for the rest of your three-dimensional shapes, I want you to build a cone and a cube. Then for your <clears throat> two-dimensional shapes, I would like you to build a circle, rectangle, square, triangle and challenge yourself and see if you could do a hexagon. Think about how many sides a hexagon has. All right, so there's my first one. My first one is a circle. Remember it is flat. If I pick this up, I really can't get it to roll. It is a flat two-dimensional shape. So I want you to continue working with your Play-Doh in creating those two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes that we have been learning. You can also go around your house and see if you can find some of the shapes that are the ones that you are building.